My name is Max Stavey, I'm the CEO of um, 3D Burrito and uh, we have a marketplace for 3D printables uh, and uh, we're working on a new platform that we will launch in October. So I, it was, um, I have a, a cheap 3D printer at home uh, that I used to experiment with and I realized that, um, um, that most people are not going to design their own models. I was uh, uh, constantly searching Thingiverse for, for a model to print and uh, and I realized that we needed a marketplace for design models that you, that people can print at home. I was comparing um, Thingiverse with Shapeways and I so uh, and I, I think there's a big uh, gap in quality between these two marketplaces because uh, Thingiverse is mainly hobbyists who upload their own uh, models that they make at home and, and at Shapeways they have professional designers who actually make a living uh, and uh, so, so um, the, the platform that we are currently working on it's, it's, it's going to pro provide a secure solution for our designers so that uh, this is something that we've been in touch with a lot of designers and they are worried about uh, illegal sharing of files and, and this is a huge issue if you are going to make uh, professional designers upload their models and make them available for printing at home and not just through services like Shapeways. Uh, we need to provide a secure solution uh, and that's what we're working on uh, and it's really exciting. Yeah. The promise of 3D printing is uh, local production. Uh, you can print at home or through a local printing service like printing shops uh, and it's for a designer they can they can make a product or a design and instantly sell it uh, with no upfront costs, no uh, inventory. And we can really speed up uh, the release of new exciting products and uh, it's limitless uh, creativity. Uh, and it's, uh, I think it's like much, much like the App Store, uh, that we, it, we, it will create a, a new ecosystem for, for makers and uh, and designers and it's really uh, great. <laughs> um, as the DIY uh, tech market expands, how do you think the 3D burrito will progress? You already have a new platform mm -hmm. coming into play, but how do you see like five years from now, how do you see like the um, like 3D printing environment changing as a whole and how do you think you're going to adapt? So yeah, we, we want to be the leading marketplace for 3D models. Uh, and we're going to uh, offer printing at home, but also uh, a, market, a marketplace for uh, printing services that can join our uh, platform and, and offer their services uh, to consumers who don't have a 3D printer at home. Because we, we to accelerate the adoption of 3D printing, you need to make it uh, uh, consumer friendly. Uh, and right now it's a, a small market, but, but, but it's a, a, a huge market in, in a couple of years. Uh, we already see uh, the potential in jewelry, in toys and uh, ceramics. Uh, it's, uh, uh, the potential is uh, it's, it's huge. Uh, and, and we want to be the, the marketplace where people uh, exchange uh, great uh, products. If you look at 3D printing, it's uh, people can uh, you, you can have a designer in in in, in um, Australia who, who can sell their product next day to a consumer in America, uh, and it's uh, it's really about uh, connecting people all over the world and sharing ideas. And for us, it, it's it has it, it has worked real well to to. Uh, can, can uh, work online, and we think this is the new generation of uh, in, of uh, internet t uh, entrepreneurs who who are, are going to work uh, uh, without the, the limits of uh, of um, 
of uh, it, that can work together glo in a global environment, uh, in a global marketplace. So we're launching our uh, platform in October, uh, and anyone can visit our website at 3dburrito.com and sign up for an early access. Uh, and we will contact you with the, uh, with an invite uh, as soon as possible. So uh, ahead of our uh, official launch.